In this video, I'm going to walk you through a process that we used on our client's pipeline using Keep Pro to be able to automate the different stages in which um, clients or contacts move through those different elements. So if you're familiar with Keep Pro, you have the option for easy automations as well as advanced automations. Now, in this client's case, there are several things that have to happen on each stage. So we like to use the advanced automation to build that out. I'm going to show you that in just a second. So what we have here on each one of their stages, now they're in the insurance and each insurance um, industry. So they have the entire pipeline of how people would move through this. Now, for each stage, what we do is we create enter and exit tags. So to keep things clean within the tagging interface, we have a category called automation triggers. And in there, we have each of the tags and they follow a consistent naming invention. So INS stands for insurance, the stage name, and then exit or enter. And with that, within the system here, if we go in and we look at it, if they exit the stage, then they're applying the exit tag. Pretty straightforward, right? Uh, and then if they enter the stage, then they're going to um, have the tag for enter applied to that, okay? Now, one of the things uh, that we like to also do in here is we then like to go ahead and let's say they, let's go here, I'll just show you here. So if they're coming to this stage here, so signed, and they're exiting that one. So we're going to exit that one. So they are going to exit the stage and then it's going to add the exit tag in here okay but we also want to scroll down here we're going to remove the enter tag for that okay so let's see signed by client so we're going to go in here we're going to call it signed by client the enter tag now we're going to immediately do that so that's what's going to happen if they exit the stage they're going to be applied the exit tag and they're also going to remove the enter tag. Now, why do we want to do that? Well, we want to do that because it's called tag cleaning and those enter and exit tags have no other purpose aside from firing automation in the advanced side. So it's important that you want to clean those up. So obviously if they move that stage, the enter one doesn't need to be on there. Okay. Now let's go over here and flip over to the advanced automation. Now we have built this process here um, and we build it out just in little streams uh, of each of the different stages. Now for each of the stage, so stages here, enter the stage for the app, e app started. So when that enter tag is applied, they're going to fire through this. Now if there's multiple stages in here, for example, if there was a task and a couple emails uh, to happen, those will fire. Now, if they exit that stage, this is the exit tag that gets applied. Okay, pretty straightforward. We wanna achieve these goals and exit them out of that. Now, remember how we, we put the automation to remove the exit tag or the enter tag upon exiting? We also have these residual exit tags that are applying there. Now, if your sequence for your client is linear, meaning that the prospect is always going to go step by step by step and they're not going to skip a step okay if they're going step by step by step then what you could have happen is when they enter the next stage it removes the exit tag from the previous stage and you could build that in here if in this case with this client there are stages later on where they may jump from this stage to um, this stage or to approve right and they're not sequential that's why it's important to put in a very simple tag maintenance. And all this is doing is looking for any of the exit tags to get applied. When they get applied, okay, they're gonna achieve that goal the moment it's applied, but then we want to remove all the exit tags again because we don't know which order they're gonna be fi firing in, sorry. You know, they could go from stage one to three or they could even back step and things like that. So we want to then clean out all the exit tags again so that they're always going to be fresh. It's going to achieve that goal when it's applied because it's momentarily going to hit and then it's going to remove them. You know, if you want to make sure that, you know, that doesn't cause any issues, you could put a one minute delay timer in here um, as well. 
and you just want to make sure that it's one minute, it will fire any day, any time. Then you know there is a, a one minute delay for that to apply, uh, and then it's going to strip them all out. So that allows us to have this maintenance happening um, for those sequences that are not going to be linear step by step by step. So that's how we utilize the deals in Keep Pro and leverage the insurance, uh, or not the insurance, leverage the advanced automation side of the platform. If you have any questions about this campaign or any things that you've run up with yours, please comment below this video uh, and I will gladly respond to that um, as soon as I see it.